Miles and Andy are the main characters of Glass Onion. A Knives Out mystery, and the movie raises the question of why the former invited the latter to his island once the mystery is solved. Glass Onion's first act is set up as a traditional whodunit by writer-director Rian Johnson, with Blanc attending Miles Island hideaway and suspecting foul play. The film's non-linear storyline, however, makes it plain that Blanc and Andy both played by Janelle Monae arrived on Miles Island together. It turns out that Andy is Helen, the twin of the former. Andy was found dead days before the island getaway, with Helen suspecting one of the attendees. After telling Daniel Craig's Benoit Blanc of her suspicions, the duo travel to the island, using Andy's invitation, and mingle with the other invited guests. However, knowing of Andy's death and the film revealing that Miles' former Hulk actor Edward Norton was the one who killed her, the question remains as to why Andy received an invitation in the first place. Reasons why Andy could have received an invitation from Miles, there are several explanations as to why Miles would have invited Andy. The box might have been delivered prior to Miles killing his former business partner, according to one theory. First off, the film does a great job of establishing the rift between Andy and Miles as a result of the latter forcing the former out of her firm and seizing complete control. The other guests are astonished to find Andy there before disclosing that she is truly Helen. This is due to the strained connection between her and Miles. But if Miles had sent the invitation before killing Andy, that would account for her presence among the eccentric group of characters in Glass Onion. However, the choice to send Andy an invite might have been an uncharacteristically smart move on Miles Braun's part. It is implied that he normally invites Andy, but doesn't expect her to arrive. If he didn't invite her after murdering her, it would demonstrate that he knew she was dead, so the invite could have been sent to cover his own tracks. While a happenstance of timing or a clever diversion might be behind Andy's glass onion invite, the invitation has been seen by some audiences as a plot hole, considering Miles' later murder of Andy. Is Miles sending Andy an invitation a glass onion plot hole? No matter when the invitation was sent, Miles giving it to Andy is not a plot hole for Netflix's glass onion. The aforementioned motives are probably sufficient for Miles to extend the invitation if it was sent before Andy's murder, which happened only a week at most prior to the getaway. Miles' murder of Andy has no bearing on it. If the invitation was delivered after Andy was murdered, there would be a plot hole because Miles would know she had been killed and wouldn't send one. However, this argument can be refuted by pointing out that Miles is attempting to hide the fact that he killed Andy. According to the movie, Miles intended to kill Andy in order to silence her after she forewarned him via email that she had located the napkin needed to regain control of Alpha. As a result, it's plausible that Miles left Andy an invitation at her home to cover his tracks because, prior to Glass Onion's finale, he wouldn't have invited Andy if he had known she was dead. This way, when Andy's body was found, the police would find Miles' invitation under the guise of reconciling with her and likely rule him out as any kind of suspect. Either way, Miles sending Andy an invitation in Glass Onion makes sense for various reasons.